everyone, it's me, Tiago. So more than a year ago, I made a video called Things People Say When You're Vegetarian, and um, yeah, that was a long time ago when I was vegetarian. I still contributed to the dairy and egg industries, which I'm not proud of doing, but I didn't know any better. Now I do. And you can too if you educate yourself and click the links in the description. I have to put all those links in the description again. Then, later, I made a video called Things People Say When You're Vegan, and I'm making part two of that now because I don't know if it did well, probably. But these videos, like, the where I talk and then it like, goes to a little clip and then it does a thing, and that, like, those are fun. And, yeah. I feel like I have to make up for my dumb video last week, so that's what I'm doing. <laughs> also, I'm uploading on time today, which is, like, wonderful because it's been a while since I uploaded on time. And, in other news, I just hit 600 subscribers on this channel. Thank you so much for everyone who just subscribed. That is Amazing, incredible. I just hit 500, like, the day after Thanksgiving, I think. Maybe the day before. I don't know. Right around Thanksgiving, I hit 500. And now I just hit 600, and it was just a few months, which is absolutely incredible. Thank you so much for... I just said this. Wow. Okay. Anyway, keep subscribing. Let's see if we can get to 700. Eventually, maybe even 1,000. That's my goal right now. All right, without further ado, let's get right into the video. All right, so our first one. Number one. Bacon. Roll the clip. I admire your cause, but like, how do you live without bacon, you know? <laughs> well, once I realized that the taste of bacon doesn't justify taking the life of the pig who has to die for it, I realized that it wasn't worth it. But like, it's bacon. I'm sure you've heard this before, if you are vegan or vegetarian or anything. Um, yeah, it's very annoying, but it's a, it's a very common argument that like, because bacon is good, can't go vegan, because who cares about pigs, right? Alright, moving right along, number two is personal choice. Roll a clip. Hey, I respect your choice to go vegan, but stop pushing it on me. Eating meat is my own personal choice. Is it really a personal choice if it involves a victim? If your choice directly impacts the life of another living being, it's not really personal anymore. And also, animal agriculture is destroying our planet, so your personal choice is killing everyone on Earth. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. You can't just push your opinions on me like that. I want to stay willfully ignorant so I can continue paying these obviously inhumane industries and feel fine about it. Can't you just accept that? This is another, like, commonly used and very annoying argument against veganism that it's my personal choice to pay someone to literally slit the throats of animals all day. If you are paying someone to murder someone else, that's not your choice. Okay, well, it is your choice. It's not your personal choice. That makes more sense. Number three is processed food. Go to the clip. What's that? Mm, it's vegan cheese. It's amazing how good these vegan substitutes are getting. See, this is why I don't get veganism. It's like so unhealthy. Everything you eat is so processed. Well, veganism isn't really about health, though it can be super healthy. Just because we're ethically opposed to the animal agriculture industries doesn't mean that we don't like food that tastes good, or that reminds us of food we'd like before we're vegan. Anyway, most omnivores eat a lot of processed food too, so it's not just vegans. But like, if you're gonna be vegan, do it all the way, you know? Go eat some kale or something. This is one that I get from like my family a lot, that like, oh, veganism, can't do that because the food is processed. But like, meanwhile, they're out here eating all this like, processed, non-vegan food, and they're fine with that. Like, they don't have a problem with that. It's just because I like to eat cheese sometimes because they have cheese all the time, but my cheese is made out of processed plants. That can't have that, no. Okay. The last one is number four, names. I, I feel like that title's kind of confusing, but just, like, roll the clip and you'll see what I'm talking about. What is this? Vegan cheese? Why do you have to call it cheese? It's it's obviously not cheese. Well, because most people aren't born vegan and grow up liking cheese, and then when they go vegan, they still want to eat it. So they're just looking for a vegan version of it. It's not labeled to confuse people, it's just labels what it is. Vegan cheese. But, like, it isn't cheese. Like, can't you think of a different word for it? When they make gluten-free bread, can they still call it bread? Yeah, but it's still bread. Right, this is still cheese. It's just dairy-free. But this isn't cheese. This is made out of plants. Like, just call it something else. <sighs> is a hot dog made out of a dog? What? No. Then why do you call it that? Because that's what it's called. Isn't normal cheese just congealed cow breast milk? I guess so, but like, that's just what it's called. Like, it was called cheese first. But words can change meanings. They've done that all throughout human history. Okay, but like, this still isn't cheese. <sighs> I haven't gotten this one very many times. I've heard it like one time personally, but it's one that I hear other vegans talking about a lot. If you click up here, it'll bring you to a video by those annoying vegans. They're a different YouTube channel that have way more subscribers than me, but like, they make funny, cool videos too. And um, the, this one is like a little skit thing about this specific topic, but yeah, 
That's funny. Go watch it. Yeah, so this is like also very annoying. I mean, you just watched the clip. I don't really need to summarize it here. I don't know why I keep doing that. I'm not good at these videos. But yeah, it's annoying. That's pretty much all you need to know. People feel like because we call our vegan food what it is replicating, th that we're like misleading people somehow. It doesn't really make sense because pretty much every vegan alternative says like vegan on it. It doesn't just say like cheese. <laughs> Enjoy your cheese. It's like plant-based, vegan. They're like, I don't know. Like it, it tells you that it's vegan. It's not confusing. Anyway, as you can see, these things trigger me a little bit, but that's why I made the video, so I could share that with all of you. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit the like button down there, leave a comment down below telling me like what you want me to do next, or like if you liked the video, or if you disagree with me, leave a comment down there, and I'd be happy to talk to you, and like, see what your ideas are. I want to hear your opinions. Yay. Um, yeah. Subscribe, hit the button, let's get to 700 next. That would be amazing. Thank you so much. And click the little bell to get notifications. I usually upload on Saturdays. I'm supposed to upload on Saturdays, but I've been uploading late on Sundays because I'm lazy and I like procrastinating, so sorry. I'm uploading on Saturday now, so that's good. Unless this is going up late, because I'm filming on Saturday in the afternoon, so I probably have time to edit. But if I don't, then like, I don't know, sorry. I just talked for a long time and that was supposed to be like the ending. I'm not doing too well in this video. I guess that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.